right here it's price i to bring you another brand new video of how i'm daily trading all right so today i just want to show you guys what i'm currently on without further ado just come let's go straight to the computer screen so i call this analysis from here we first go on a buy from here and the people in the team they ate from that that's people in the telegram and on instagram i dropped that on my instagram too So here's another entry that I have here. So just check it out. On my phone right here, you'd notice that I had lots of entries stacked. So one very, very interesting, you see my stop is already here. I already broke even that red thin line. You can see the stop right there, that red line. That's my SL right now. So I'm currently up about 5,200 right now. So this is an account I started with 26,000, moved it to 40,000, half it again, moved it to 30,000, half it again. So you see the history here. So if I just put it right here on, Last week, you're going to see the profit that we've made for last so, so far so good. This week, I've made $7,000. So for those who are wondering if it's a real account, yes, it is. So that's how it does. And I've made withdrawal of 7000 So for this month, if I'm to show you for total of this month performance, you see, I've made profit of 17000 withdrawal 27000 So these are just the whole parameters. And I'm just trading just one pair, which is GBPSD. I'm never going to see any other thing that I'm trading. Okay? I'm just trading just GBPSD. So with that said, let's head straight to um the analysis that i called out for them and i still told them that look at it yeah that they, they, they uh that this trade will still go far more and they shouldn't just close so this was my stack web price was here and i sent it to them and they also it and so the reason why I'm, i do stacking i'm also going to be explaining very soon so hit it hard if you miss the first don't miss this one so this is this one i sent to them so for those who missed this entry this first one you shouldn't miss this one as well so that's what I'm just saying now. Why? What gave me this confidence? Why this so much confidence now? Yes. Each time price gets to a uh, low of the week or high of the week, I make videos and tons of videos in, regarding my strategy. Each time it gets to price gets to a high of the week or low of the week, any of these levels, price will always want to touch it and it this flashes up and gives up a chart pattern W. So this is a chart pattern that has changed my life that I've been using to trade accounts from create a moon account of twenty-five thousand dollars to two hundred forty thousand dollars in six months. So I'm also trying to replicate the same thing again, doing it live. So come check. So you can see price giving us a double bottom. Here's the first, here's the second. So on top, these two price moved up. That's for today's entry. Anytime you see this gray art box, that's my entry. Here's another one again. Small, it might be very slight, but there's always a candle flash. Another one, this is a tiny M again, and it dropped. Okay, this is a tiny W went up. So it's a tiny M right here too, and it dropped. Come on here. Look at a W, a W. It dropped right here, moved up, came back right here. We also caught this one. So I've made videos on this, and I also caught it live. So this is a bigger W that started on Monday. So this is the first M, first leg of the M. This is the second M. So price moved up right here, came straight down to this point, moved up, and then turned. So this is the candlestick chart pattern that has changed my life. So if you guys can actually sit down, take your time, and study your chart, over most especially on GBPUS and most GBP pairs, you find out that these patterns keep repeating itself. Now let me show you some more examples. Let me show you some more examples that I've been trading. Any time that you see put, I put out this box, just know that that's the point I went either long or short. Okay? If I put out this box, I went I went short right here. You can see that. And you always see that each time you see this one to an M. Price moved up, came back down, move here. This pattern that is this way. Always fish it out whenever you see it. Go crazy with it. So this is candlestick that changed my life for good, guys. So I'm sure you guys can as well replicate the same thing. And one thing that is really very much important for me is understanding price action, understanding risk management. Know when to scale in and know when not to scale in. Like everything that I've got right here on my PC that I'm scaling in, I know the lot size and I know the risk at which I'm putting on. So I'm not allowed this on a small account. I'm not allowed to risk more than $500 on a small account. Okay. Not as much as I'm within the scope of my amount of money that I'm willing to risk for that day, I'm good. And on the bigger account of the 25, this is a small account. You notice, come this one, I'm on profit of about this is a different account. This is $4,000 profit right now, whereas this is a small account, $2,000 profit. Yes, so there are two different accounts. So I control this small one on my smaller iPhone and this phone I'm using to film, and I also control it through here. So there are two different things. So this one, this one is mirrored, whereas this one and this one is mirrored. So these are just two things. So I think as much as my risk management is in check, I have my risk management, I've done my positions at calculator, and how did I do my risk management? 
let me show you that too. I come to baby peeps position size calculator. Can you see that? Baby peeps.com slash position size calculator. And I put in my parameters right here. So the account this morning was 22000 So 22000 dollars And I'm willing to risk 1% at that as at that time. 20 pips stop loss, put in GPS and I can calculate. So if this trade whips so I'm gonna be losing $220. And this is the loss size. So I divide this loss size based on the risk parameter that I already use. So these and uh, many other things are what I do. So it's just like a trade break there, fast break down it's moving on. So soon I'll just start closing now and I'll just call it a day. So that's it. That I just keep it simple and I trade the in there. All right, uh, make sure you guys subscribe. If you like this kind of breakdown, I'll keep dropping this. And if there is any video suggestion, maybe if there is anything you're not, you're not really getting clearly from what I'm doing, drop a comment in the comment section. Then I will just have it then and make a video about it. So see you guys next time. Peace out.